Little sweetie. I will never leave you again, no matter what, my dear. Never. Never, okay? Cobra. Cobra, I'm really sorry. I couldn't protect you. I was so scared that something was going to happen to you. I was... I was so scared. Come in, Hussam. We've gotten ourselves into some real trouble. No word about Yigit and Sehan yet, huh? There is. Apparently they got into quite a fight. They both shot their weapons. One of Sehan's men died, and Sehan and Yigit got wounded. But to complicate things, the prosecutor got involved. What kind of nonsense are you talking about, huh? Did they start a gunfight in front of the prosecutor? They did, sir. Yigit is with them as we speak. But why didn't he arrest the both of them while everything was going down? I can't say for sure, sir. God help me, what a mess. There's always something going wrong. So what are we going to do now, huh? What would you like us to do, sir? Nothing for right now. Let's wait a bit and see what happens. Okay, boss. Thank God. I'm so thankful that you got away from that man alive. God spared your life. Thankfully, he did. Think about poor Sybil. Anyway, it's all over now, okay, girl? We'll get through this. We will all get through this. I can't go through something like this again, Daria. I can't take it. This is the price we pay for being around these men. Either you will put up with it, or you get yourself out of it. I came to seek shelter. And why did I decide to do that? Because I wanted to be safe, you know? It isn't really their fault, you know? We're building our lives on fault lines here. But what if I had died, Daria? Oh, God forbid, though. It could have happened. Then what would have happened? My daughter would have been left all alone in this world. I don't want that to happen to her. My daughter will not be subjected to that. Okay. She won't have to suffer that. Don't worry about that right now. Look, you're back with us now. Elif is here with us as well. Okay, just don't think those thoughts. My dear friend. 